What's good, YouTube? It's your boy, What's Good, Elias, and I'm back with another video today for you guys. I already posted a video about minutes ago, but I'm gonna post you another one, man. I know I've been getting some comments, well, not really comments, but I know people need help on how to get your team better. Okay, or how to get your team to be ready for these challenges that they have out here, man. And I'm gonna help you, man. I'm gonna help y'all, man. So, what you wanna do to get your team better, man? is play season all right i'm not gonna play a whole season game but the first rule is play season because when you play season they give you cards for you to go to your sets and put it on this um old l beckham that they got at the end and when you finish those super bowl sets or whatever the uh season they give you a season master which means you're done with the whole season, you won the Super Bowl, and you put it on the Season Master. And you need 10 of those. Now right now, I need three more of Season Master and Division Master to get the Odell Beckham to 99. This beautiful card with the greatest stats ever. Now second, make sure you do these NFL moments. These NFL moments get you one gold player, two silver players, and three trophies. Now these, sometimes I got an elite player out of these NFL moments packs. Don't always believe in what these words say about you're gonna get a gold player, you're gonna get a silver player. Because sometimes they'll probably surprise you and you'll get an elite player, you know what I'm saying? So if you wanna get your team better by doing that, then do NFL moments as well. But in order to get these, you have to do, like it says on the uh, information, you have to do either playing seasons, head-to-head, -head, or league matches. You can't get these in lot of ways. You have to do something else. Third, make sure you do these road to the rings. Stop buying these dudes on the auctions. These dudes are going to be cheap. Yeah, they're very cheap because they're not high overalls. But if you want these guys, I suggest you do the road to rings every Friday and every Sunday. They're going to be there every Friday, every Sunday. And if you want these guys, grind for it. It's not hard. It's one, cha it's one challenge every four hours. And every four hours you do those challenges, you get at least, depending on how many staminas or you got or how many uh, lifers you got, you can use there. I think there are about four stamina to use each of those uh, challenge. So if you got 28, you could do seven road to rings, and you'll get seven rings. And out of those five, you can do either these uh, elite ring packs to get that one elite ring that you need for these players, or you can acquire these. You can acquire these uh, packs and put them on these guys that you need. Okay. So that's why I was like, uh, man, these guys, they won't help on getting better players on the team. This is the way they can do it. Fourth, make sure you go to players. Of course you will go to players. They have each and every one of these sets for you to get a player. And I will start off by going right here. It's called teams. What you want to do is whoever player that they say you have to get, for example, look. You need three bronze players for the Bills, four silver players, two bronze trophies, and two silver trophies. You see, all these will help you. Okay, right now I got one silver player, and I got a whole bunch of bronze players. But if you do these challenges, you get 2,500 in coins, and you get a player pack, which will give you one gold player on that team. It'll probably be a 74 overall to an 83, depending on who they got on their team that's good. And if you do all these, you will get 32 gold players from each team. And that will set your team high, bro. So do these and also do these captains and MVPs, bro. I'm telling you. If you do teams, MVP, and captains, your team will be high enough to be a 90 at least. Especially all these players. All these players are 90 and above. Now, some of these I already completed, but most of these I didn't need because 
you know, I went to the auction house. You know, that's the easiest way to get those 92s and 94s instead of doing all them challenges and grinding. But if you want to get players the easy way and don't want to spend your money, want to save it, do these challenges right here, man. They're not hard. The hardest thing that's probably going to be is getting a, a captain thing. But everything else, like the gold players, the elite trophies, all that should be easy for you guys, man. Easy as peasy. And you can do MVPs. MVPs, all these guys are 92 and above players. I did, I think, at least four of these guys. And um, three of them were O-lines and one was a safety. But if you do all these, man, 96 overall team right there. You got about five or six linebackers. You got a quarterback. You got a running back. You got safeties, DBs, D linemen, at least two to three quarterbacks. And you got a bunch of wide receivers. You can't beat that. And you get a good fullback. You get Marcel Reese. You can't beat that. So if you need a fullback, he's a good one. He's a 92. And then plus that trucking, that's going to give him a 93. So these are all good. All these player sets are good for you to help your team, bro. And you can do upgrades. You can just go here, go to gold players, set these trophies, put four bronze and put uh, five silvers. You will most likely get a gold player. I don't know who, because I only did it twice because my team was getting elite at the end of the game. So I was like, I really don't need to do this. Or you can do these elite player packs. You can do these over here. All these would be good to get your team. Okay. So if you want your team to be set high, so you can do those gauntlet challenges to do those domination challenges. See, my team is a 94. It's not high enough, but it's high for me to be able to beat teams that that's not better than mine. You know, I got the Isaac Bruce, Sammy Watkins, Almond Green, whatever. And I got a good defense. I mean, it's a 93. I'm going to get it higher as soon as I get players that I know that will boost it up. Like, you know, linebackers and DBs and stuff. All my DBs are 93s and... The lowest dude on my defense is uh, Callis Campbell. But I want to bring this video out to you guys. So, also, last thing. Create a league. Get people to join it. Okay? Because you can click over here and press achievements. Now, each of these achievements have tiers. So, in order to get those players, you have to do tiers. But you can't do it by yourself. You need everybody to help you. So, like, for example, I did six of seven of the um, Unstoppable pack. Now, each of those, you get a pack. You get different packs. You probably get a pro pack, a veteran pack, a legendary pack. And look at this. If I get 1,500 wins, I get an elite pump return pack. And then after I finish that, I would get Devin Hester, the 99 overall. This is another way you can get players, too. See, these next one, if I get 300,000 yards, I get a legendary pack. That's in rushing or in passing. If I get 500K, I will get a legendary pack. So these will also help you to get players to boost your team if you do league. Man, thanks for watching this video, man. I hope y'all love this video. Not love it, but I hope you like this video enough to help y'all get your team better, man. Please press that subscribe button. I'm still grinding out here, still making videos for you guys to get help as much as you can. If you can't find the best video... This is probably one of the best videos to get your team better. You know, people tell you, go to the auction house and look for the cheapest player. Or snipe this player to get that player. No, nah, man, I'm teaching you guys how to build your team and grind the right way. Don't do what I did. Do the way that you want to do. You want to grind so you can shine and show those people that you can tell them, oh, I grinded by doing live events and doing leagues and doing season games for my team to get better. I ain't buy nobody off the auction house but if you need like that player then i advise you go to the auction house man hope you like this video please press that like button and press that subscribe button man splash that subscribe button and splash that like button man and what's good and i'm out